Thank you. My name's Charlotte, and I would love to share with you a really short practice from Kundalini Global that you can do anytime you find yourself triggered or in need of emotional first aid. It's really quick, you don't need any equipment, and you can adapt it to do pretty much anywhere, although maybe not on the bus. You'll see why. So you're going to start just sitting. You don't have to be on the floor. No matter where you are, you can be in a chair, you can be in bed, as long as you're sitting down comfortably. And you're going to start just by pinching your ears. So if you've got earrings on, just be a little bit careful. You can pinch or you can rub. Just massaging gently or just pinching and holding. And we'll be three breaths here. you'll see now why maybe not on the bus for this one. The next posture, rest your hands on your knees. And as you're going to inhale, lift your chin. And when you get to the top, stick your tongue out. And exhale, round down. And we'll do that three times. And the reason we do that, inhaling up, tongue out. Exhale down is because sticking the tongue out affects your vagus nerve, which is a key part of your stress system. One more time, inhale up, tongue out, exhale down. Then you're going to take your left hand to your right knee and just exhale and twist. Coming back to the other side, we'll do this three times, two, three is a magic number. Left hand to right knee, exhale, twist. Right hand to left knee. Last time. And continue to open that stress system in the front of the body. Take your right hand across your body. And then as you inhale, open up. We'll do that three times. And the same on the other side. And these slow movements with the breath all help to tell your system that it's safe to be calm, it's safe to come back into that anchored place where you and polyvagal theory you might call your ventral vagus system, that system of rest and connect. You're able to do this as well, and everyone can do it a little bit. Just going to move, twisting side to side, and come down as far as you can. There's no wrong or right. If this is what it looks like for you, that's fine. Or you might find you're coming right down over your knee. Just do that a few times. Then we're going to use the root lock, which is um, where we're going to tense and release one of the key energetic centers in the body. So you're going to breathe in through your nose. Make sure you relax your belly as you breathe in. With the breath held in, pull up on your pelvic floor and suck in your lower belly. Drop your chin a little bit. So you're pulling in and up. And then release the tension. Exhale fully. And with the breath held out, Lift up pelvic floor, pull in lower belly. So you're sucking in and up. And release. And finally, you will do three really calming breaths. We'll do that breath by breathing in through pursed lips as if you're going to whistle. And if it makes a whistling sound, so much the better. But in through pursed lips. Out through the nose. And as you breathe out, release your shoulders. In through pursed lips. Out through the nose. One last time. Out through the nose. And there you have it. That is five minute practice that ought to be able to do a lot to help you come back 
to yourself if you find yourself in need of some emotional first aid.